we believe that competition is a great thing, but uh, fair competition for all is really what we're after. A senator wants to stop deceptive gas prices here in Nebraska. Good evening, everyone. Thank you for joining us. Senator John McAllister says some gas stations aren't pricing fairly. He argues it's not fair to customers and it's giving the competition a bad name. Channel 8 Eyewitness News reporter Nicole Cousins joins us now with more in tonight's top story. Nicole. Rod and Megan, testifiers with the petroleum industry said today they usually don't like more regulations, but this one is needed. A Nebraska senator says a local gas station chain's deceptive pricing schemes are hurting customers and damaging the reputation of Nebraska's other fill-up centers. Senator John McAllister introduced a new bill Tuesday that would stop the practice after he says he was fooled firsthand. When I saw the line of cars just behind two pumps and the other fuel stations had much higher prices, my good mood turned into anger. Fat Dogs, owned by Wilkinson Companies out of North Platte, was specifically named in Tuesday's testimony in front of the Agriculture Committee. Its five locations are known for having a sign showing cheap gas prices, but only at two pumps. The rest, according to testifiers, can be up to 70 cents higher per gallon. Such deceptive practices confuse motorists, resulting in wasteful consumer spending and ill feelings towards the retailer, the local community, and our state. Several gas service companies agree that more regulation is needed, especially along the I-80 corridor where most of Fat Dog's pumps are located and where thousands of tourists and truckers drive every year. I believe that most of these complaints have come from people that do not reside in the state of Nebraska. I depend on tourism dollars in North Platte. It's very important. Sap Brothers CEO Don Quinn, who has stations in eight states, says they don't have this problem with this type of competition anywhere else. We think it just gives this whole state of Nebraska, not only petroleum marketers, a black eye. We reached out to Fat Dogs and Wilkinson companies. They did not return any of our calls. Now, only one opponent testified today. He was against the bill because the wording um, may hurt some rural gas stations. The committee says they're working to take a look at that language to make sure this clearly addresses only deceptive pricing and it won't harm companies that are working to make a living.